Visby Medical was developed to democratize infectious disease testing, make available highly accurate tests to anybody, anywhere, and for any disease. The incredible thing about PCR machines is that they're incredibly accurate. What we're trying to do is to make them incredibly accessible to respiratory, sexually transmitted infections, and a whole host of other infections. Imagine a patient entering the emergency room. They're not allowed into surgery until they have been screened as COVID negative. The portability of this device, its accuracy, and the fact that it gives an answer in 30 minutes or less is essential. We said, wouldn't it be great if we could run a format like a pregnancy test, uh, but doing infectious disease? We've run 2,000 units in a clinical study with multiple operators. There was no training whatsoever. They opened up the guide. Really, it went, it went very smoothly. There was very little error. As an academic, you work very hard to publish papers, and I always wanted to see how the ideas that we create in the lab can actually make it all the way to actually helping people. That was really the inspiration that started Visby Medical. The U.S. federal government has taken considerable interest in this device because it meets many of the needs for testing for COVID-19. As a consequence, the NIH has identified Visby Medical as a company it will support with federal money. We got to the point where we have a device that actually works well. We started a clinical study. Our PCR test and a big PCR machine actually do show matching results. It's the first single-use dis disposable PCR device. Um, nobody's ever built a device like this. You have to bring interdisciplinary teams together. Engineers, molecular biologists, bench scientists, surface chemists. We want all of that kind of under one roof. We don't farm any of that out because we want really great collaboration. This is really one of our core strengths, the ability to go from an early planning stage all the way through product development and taking something through FDA. We've put a lot of effort into building something good, so it's a matter of scaling that up and getting it out in the market and, and, and learning. We will include additional products over the next few years, which may include sepsis, antimicrobial resistance in hospitals, urinary tract infections, one of the most important things that we've done here over the last few years was to have a true close partnership with the laboratorians that really helped us all the way through clinical trials. We would love to talk to you, we'd love to hear your ideas, feedback, thoughts on what we should be doing into the future.